קדוש, 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 השם יהוה, סבאיו, קדוש, קדוש. קדוש, השם יהוה, סבאיו, קדוש, 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 השם יהוה סבאיו קדוש 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 השם יהוה סבאיו קדוש קדוש קדוש, השם יהוה סבאיו, קדוש, 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 השם יהוה סבאיו, קדוש, 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 השם יהוה סבאיו, קדוש, 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 השם יהוה סבאיו. קדוש, 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 השם יהוה סבאיו, 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 קדוש, 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 השם יהוה שבאו, 
कदूश 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 यहुआ सबायो किफिर रुवाश दराश योधे वाभे कौसरे तो किफिर रुवश दराश योधे वाभे कौसरे तो किफिर रुवश दराश योधे वाभे कौसरे तो हाले लुया This is Psalm 34 verse number 10 which says young lion may go hungry but they that wait upon the Lord shall never lack anything that is good Hallelujah Ke fer rush da rash yodhe vaave khosare tove हाले लुया के फेर रोश द राश योधे वावे कौसरे तोवे दे दैट वेट अपॉन द लोड दे दैट सीक द लोड डिलीजेंटली सीक द लोड यंग लायन द कब्ज द वर्ल्ड इज के फेर यंग लायन रोश means lack lack or it means to become poor to become needy kefir <coughs> rosh and the word rave is to suffer famish or hunger which is the root word of rosh but they that seek the hebrew word is the rush they that seek diligently they that pursue insistently they that inquire of the lord they that search they that seek out <coughs> whom yod he vav he whom do you have to seek not the world not the material things of the world you have to seek your deva bhe hallelujah such people shall not lack hebrew word is kosare kosare they will never want never lack they will never have lesson <coughs> never fail never decrease will never go down and also this word is used in a sense of mourning they will never mourn good thing tove hebrew word is tove good best precious fine wealth beautiful prosperity favor abundance hallelujah hosea chapter number 3 verse number 5 says seek the lord and fear the lord and the lord will bestow upon you his goodness Hallelujah. Thank you Jesus. Lord we bless your name. Lord we bless your name this morning early morning Lord. Bless your name, bless your name. Hallelujah. Let me read for you <coughs> verse number Psalm thirty-four, verse number nine. Also, verse number nine says, "Oh, fear the Lord, ye His saints, for there is no want to them that fear Him. Fear the Lord, walk in His holy fear. Don't take God for so much 
as granted don't become overly familiar with the lord the spirit of familiarity with the lord is deadly so many christians have become too familiar with the lord that the lord has become sort of a household commodity for them and they don't stand in the awe of the lord they don't walk in the fear of the lord they have no reverence for the lord in their heart therefore the lord does not reveal himself mighty and powerful they never experience the power the might the splendor the majesty the glory of the lord because they have brought the lord down to a very derogatory level you keep an awe you keep fear you keep reverence <coughs> and never let the love and the honor in your heart lessen in any way for the lord oh fear the lord oh his saints for there is no want for them that fear him they who fear him will never lack anything they will never famish they will never be impoverished because they fear him they stand in his awe they revere him they honor him <coughs> hallelujah they always render unto the lord the utmost of their heart always at all time they do not have mood swings you know your mood swing means absolutely nothing before the lord and verse number 10 the young lion do lack there would be the word of the lord is very true lion is the king of the jungle the most dominant force in the jungle and lion can get his prey whenever wherever he wants but the lord says even though the lion is such a strong and mighty predator yet he would not be able to catch food for his children young lion do lack and suffer hunger they may sleep empty stomach but they that seek the lord number one category is of them that fear the lord and they who fear the lord <coughs> with utmost reverence they are the one who will become the seeker of the lord in order for you to become a consistent seeker of the lord you have to have the spirit of the fear of the lord then you become a relentless pursuer of god's presence and the reward is the same the reward for the those who fear the lord they lack absolutely nothing and they who seek the lord shall not want any good thing it is one and the same thing agar aapko blessing chahiye agar aapko barkatein chahiye to aapko ye kaam karna hai agar prosperity chahiye to ye kaam karna hai समझ रहे मेरी बात आप यू हैव टू सीक हिम यू हैव टू रन आफ्टर हिम यू हैव टू परसू हिम इन होलीनेस एंड प्योरिटी जेड़ा लभदाए वो पौधा है खड़कावे जो खुल जाता है रहमत दा बानी यसु जी दुखियां नु गल नल लौंदा ए गहरे जख्म दिलांदे हो गहरे जख्म दिलांदे यसु तो सकदा करिए जे विश्वास त सब कुछ हो सकदा त सब कुछ हो सकदा त सब कुछ हो सकदा कुछ भी नामुमकिन नहीं है वी वी प्रेड फॉर अ मैन इन ऑस्ट्रेलिया मेलबर्न ए सिख जेंटलमैन बाय द नेम ऑफ कुलबीर सिंह he was dying he was breathing his last on the ventilator and the doctors gave up hopes and this man doesn't even know the lord one of his family members knows the lord to humne prarthana kiya khudavan se and that man 
is saved by the mighty arm of the Lord. Hallelujah. खुदावन ने उसे बचा लिया खुदावन ने किसी बंदे को जो बहुत गरीब था उसको हमने वचन बताया लास्ट कुछ कुछ कपल ईयर्स पहले उनके घर में हम सर्दी में गरम कोल्ट और ब्लैंकेट देकर आए वो किसी की गाड़ी चलाता था ट्रैक्टर चलाता था एंड दे वर कॉट बाय हायर पुलिस अथॉरिटीज फॉर यू नो बीइंग अ ड्रग पैडलर एंड ऑल तो प्रभु ने उसको रेस्क्यू कर लिया हम उसके लिए प्रार्थना करके आए गॉड बेल्ड हिम आउट हाल लू या समबडी केम विद अवी डेमोनिक पोजेशन आई वेंट फॉर अ मीटिंग एंड शी हैड बिन गोइंग टू अ चर्च फॉर वन ईयर एंड बींग वेरी लॉयल इन पेइंग ऑफरिंग एंड टाइट्स बट वॉज एन डिलीवर्ड In an instant, the Lord Almighty set that woman free. In an instant. So there is a reward of waiting upon the Lord. You know, it is some sort of a forgotten malady these days. People do do not know how to wait upon the Lord. This is consumer age. Everything is very quick and instant. People want everything instantaneously. look at the word of the lord look at those sages and saints of the old time they would take quality time and wait upon the lord <coughs> before the lord would send answer to their petition they would devote quality time in seeking the lord <coughs> you know what what king david says <coughs> king david says i will wait upon the lord the lord will come and he will quicken me then i shall bear his testimony in the assembly of the righteous david says i will be before the lord i will be lying prostrate before the lord and i will not move a muscle i will only seek him i will only pray i will on i will not do anything with my carnal strength i will not do anything in my human muscles but what i will do i will do seeking him i will be waiting upon him and i will be waiting upon him i will be calling upon him i will be seeking him pursuing him and the time will arrive when the lord will come he will quicken me i will wait even though i become dead he will come and he will quicken me until and unless the lord quickens us we should not take any enterprise in our hand we shouldn't do anything with the arm of the flesh we shouldn't do our own agendas what we need to do is wait upon the lord seek him pursue him pray continually and never quit praying this is what jesus taught in 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 luke chapter number 18 he gave the example of a widow against whom a strong and a mighty adversary fought and the court case was pending in the court of a judge who was not a righteous person he was very belligerent and he would not he wouldn't have any compassion for the poor he never had any heart for the afflicted ones and this is a widow <coughs> and this judge is corrupt he could be swayed by bribe this woman could have thought many things in her mind but she did not what she did she pursued the judge daily she visited the judge daily now you know what jesus is trying to say Jesus is equating this unjust judge with the greatest judge of the heavenly supreme court who is our father Yahuwah Elohim Jesus is saying our father Jesus is saying my father and your father is the greatest judge and it is he our father the god of creation he instituted justice and judiciary 
all the courts in the world and all the all the laws and constitution all the judges and all the bar council of the lawyers they are a reflection of the judiciary in heaven god instituted judiciary all over the world god is god of justice god created the law he put <clears throat> constitution and justice all over the world so he is a judge jesus is equating this earthly judge who is corrupt who is very insolent and very indifferent to the cry of the poor doesn't care for the widow and the orphans and then jesus compares the ultimate perfect glorious judge but you know make no mistake jesus is not talking about him being your daddy your father here jesus is presenting him as the judge the judge will have everything fair and square the only hope with this perfect judge of the universe is our legal attorney whose name is yahusha hamashiah the only hope for you and me when we are in front of this glorious judge of the universe who is light in himself he will never let any sin go unpunished the only silver lining for us is the blood of the lamb and the blood has already reached the heavenly judiciary and the blood has all the capacity to plead your cause the blood has all the power to speak to the father and the blood has been given position as legal attorney in heaven hallelujah so what you need to do is keep on knocking keep on seeking keep on asking <clears throat> hallelujah ask seek and knock these are three different dimensions there is a level where you ask and there is a dimension where you begin to seek and then ultimately there is a dimension where you just stand right in front of the pearly gate and you knock it and you say heavenly father open the gates of glory hmm hallelujah let's pray father i pray in the holy name of yahusha hamashiach for angela droch for ruby sanghera for sunita kaur and lord for devinder kolar your daughter and for other precious folks of yours who sowed a seed for the celebration of festival of booth may you bless them and reward them for the seed they planted may you give back hundredfold in their bosom lord i speak your blessing i speak the blessing of sukha the blessing of sukhot to fall upon them hallelujah lord i pray for vinodini christian and vinod christian in canada that you would bless them lord that you would put your mighty hand upon them <coughs> i pray lord for pavitra kaur i pray for her husband that he will come to know you and and a brother lord that you would stretch forth your hand of healing Hashem Yahuwa Sabayo Hallelujah Hashem Yahuwa Sabayo Haya Asher Haya you bless her and bless Joyce Munir from the United States let your hand be upon her Hallelujah and Lord <clears throat> I also pray for Albert Mathias from Delhi let your hand be upon him खुदावन हम तेरा धन्यवाद करते हैं लॉर्ड वी ब्लेस यू लॉर्ड वी ब्लेस योर होली नेम लॉर्ड दिस डे एज वी फास्ट एंड एज वी सेलिब्रेट दिस ग्लोरियस फेस्टिवल लॉर्ड आई प्रे दैट यू विल मेक द लाइट ऑफ योर फेस शाइन अपॉन अ कॉन्टिनेंस मेक द लाइट ऑफ योर फेस शाइन अपॉन माई कॉन्टिनेंस Lord let the light of your face shine upon my countenance let my whole being radiate your virtue and glory lord hallelujah i pray for jasveer kaur and lord i pray for uh, 
Jasveer Kaur's health and her family. Hallelujah. I, I pray that you will pour out your blessing. People who have taken a decision to fast today, Lord, I pray that you will give them supernatural strength. Khudavand, tu apni hazuri ki blessing pour out kar. Tujhe constantly, consistently, passion ke saath, like a crazy person, hum pursue karte rahe, tujhe seek kare, Khudavand. <coughs> pour out this blessing on us, Lord Jesus. I bless you, Lord. I draw the hedge around your people. I draw the hedge of the precious blood around this home, around my household, my family, my children, my wife, my mother, my brothers, their houses. And Lord, around every loved one that you have connected with my life and ministry, all who pray, all who, Lord, stand and support, and all who even financially bless the work, you reward them, Lord, hundredfold, and you reward them thousandfold. You said, Lord, a bumper blessing which is in Deuteronomy 111, thousandfold increase. And hundredfold is your standard of the kingdom. Bless Kodavan Tera Dhanyavad. Tere naam ki mehma ho. Yeshu Masih ki jalali naam mein. Amen. Amen. Shall see you guys again five in the morning. We'll have a longer spell of devotion. Five in the morning and during the day we will have prayer spells. We'll be praying and worshipping the Lord. The Lord bless you. Amen.